Hi guys, it's me, Real Neo, Victory Over Decepticons, and today we are going to discuss the Heart Realm. That's correct. It's been a long enough time, and uh, let's get right into it, okay? Again, I am Real Neo. Wee! Sub that channel uh, if you want to, if you want to. But uh, let me hear. Let me see if I can get on here and type in. What do we want to do? We want to search Heart Realm. And I will be very quick about this. So stay with me. Alright, here we go. Search. Whee! Alright, so you get some video games. And video games and video games. And you get an Antarctic Warrior. You know, shut up and listen. Which is great. 21,000 views. Jeez, I don't think I got 21,000 views on all of the hundreds of Heart Realm videos I put up. But let's continue to move forward. Now he's a flat earther. And I have sent him a couple of requests to please take these things down. Uh, so we'll see what he does. He doesn't seem to do much YouTube anymore. So, you know, again, moving on. So anyway, you got Flat Earth here. Again, Al Antarctic Warrior. Not not trying to just focus on just that. But yeah, see? see do you see what I'm saying? This is another one that was, that was at the time talking about the Heart Realm. And then they figured it all out. And then I think they went back into the Flat Earth world. And there he is again, you know. I tell you, so speaking of uh, Native Americans, uh, I'm going to put a little bit of Russell Means on here. Rest in peace, good man, Alakota. And uh, we're just going to move forward. But uh, point being is, look guys, the heart realm was never, <laughs> was an argument that was never defeated, okay? You have to understand that. It's not defeated. So if you have an inkling for trying to actually figure something out here, uh, on YouTube for free because uh, I don't make any money on this stuff you know I got other things to do with my life but I am pretty comfortable in saying that you are in the heart realm and when they send all space programs going back 50 years now and there's no 360 degree pans when if I hand this camera to a five-year-old they're gonna 360 pan it all the way up to a 50 year old they'll 360 pan it oh here we are we're here in the heart room, you know, they'll 360 pan that thing all the way around. So, again, it's a silly thing. I, like, I think it's great they have toy rockets. I don't enjoy paying for it as a taxpayer. That's where my thing comes in. People are always looking, oh, we need to trim the fat of the United States. Well, gee, there, how about getting off of SpaceX's tip? Let them launch their little toy rockets on their own and get all excited on their own. Because I am telling you, people, no 360 degree pan means you ain't getting out of this place. So you're back into the heart realm, the living organism. So figure it out. Earth or heart? Which do you need more of? I need more Earth. That sounds like Hitler. I need more heart. That sounds like everyone. So, uh, anyway, I love you guys. Victory over Decepticons. I'll leave you with this Russell Means. And, uh, again, please sub the channel. We're going to have a nice, fun summer. We are putting an engine in my car that got stolen last year. And we're also going to be talking about the heart realm. And uh, it's a big deal. So, uh, again, if you think that, you know, you need some, you, you know, you want to be a, a debater or try to go up against the real Neo, which, you know, again, you can look through the Google thing. They don't want you to find me. So, sub the channel, hit the bell. Real Neo's on Patreon if you want to give me some money, but I ain't e-begging. I'm just trying to say that this is good advice. The advice I'm going to leave you with this next couple of minutes with Russell Means is advice that I had a very long time ago. This was recorded in 1993. And uh, think of the world we could have uh, if we had just listened to what he's saying right here. So again, victory over Decepticons. Every day is a day to kick Decepticon lies. Peace. Ah, me taco a pé. Minha malacota. Imagianta, huh? Ma quinze te os pai. Que le re sapa que. Lila waka. Ma kawaka. What I told you in my language, roughly translated, is part of what I'm bound to say when I speak to people because I come from an oral society. And I said, Hello, my relatives. I am an ally and I come from Yellow Thunder Village in our very sacred Black Hills, our holy land. Mother Earth 
here is what really it's all about. The female-male balance in the universe. As you can see, the disrespect for everything that is sacred is what's wrong with this, this society. And nothing's ever going to happen until this society accepts the fact in their heart, not in the right side of their brain, as the so-called Western scientists have ascertained, the right brain thinking, the linear mathematical equation to life. But what is needed is the knowledge and the wisdom that the earth is a living being. Even the Bible, a male-dominated religion, tells you dust to dust, that we come from the earth. And yet, Christian theology is bereft of anything about the environment. And our sacred grandmother, the Mother Earth, is what it's all about. Once we understand and know and feel that she is alive, you know, Western science has ascertained that. In the early 80s, they sank a, a shaft in Greenland, of all places, a mile or so down into the earth and brought up data for months and months. And with that data, they ascertained that the earth is a living organism in space. So now you've got your proof. You've got your proof. So please, start putting it in your heart. Get it up here, and put it here. And she's alive, and she hurts, and she feels like you and I. With that kind of respect and knowledge, then this junk, all this junk, wouldn't happen. And you will understand the value, the spiritual value of a mountain that is the breasts. The mountains are the breasts of our mother, the earth. And that's where we go for, to nurture our spirituality. Ask any religion on earth. Ask any scientist about the ions. And if you don't know what ions are, then go to your heart. I want to thank everyone for this play. I want to thank everyone for this honor. And I want to thank you for your attention. Oh, we are all related.